guys, welcome back to The Cardin. Today I've got a really exciting video because we're doing a Murphy's Magic unboxing and it's the first one we've done in about a month. So as you can see, I got lots and lots of stuff ranging from playing cards to accessories, including some clips, some storage units like you can see um, up there. Um, it's a really good one. We've got Riffle Shuffle decks, we've got some card street decks. So make sure you stick around throughout the whole video because we've got about 100 items to unbox. I think it's about 20 new products. So it's going to be an exciting video and I'm looking forward to showing you guys exactly what we got. And lastly, if you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe if you haven't already, if you do enjoy our content. So without further ado, let's get into the unboxing. Right, so let's get started. Like I said, ranges between accessories and playing cards. So we've got a few fancy uh, card clips, some have like lizard prints, some have ostrich prints. Um, this is the Litchi card card clip, um, which is really nice. You can see um, these little details up front and it's just a really nice way uh, to store your clips. We, we, do, we do have some basic eight pound clips, but we thought we'd go out and get some really nice luxurious ones. This, this is one of the ostrich clips. So just a really, just really cool design. You don't really see too many card clips like this. So if you want to jazz up your card clip collection or look a little bit more fancy when you're collecting decks we have about four different styles of these card clips in stock so getting some like the large items out of the way this is the tcc um, 15 deck cabinet and i'll basically show you exactly what this is so this is what the cabinet looks like it holds 15 decks um, it, it's already put together when you purchase it which is really nice don't have to don't have to build it um, and it's really cool. Just slide your decks in and out like so. Holds 15 decks and it's a really nice accessory to have. We, we just bought in the Sharks playing cards. So we have a lot of Riffle Shuffle decks. And this comes in a really, really cool box. As you can see, these are the Shark playing cards. This is one of Riffle Shuffle's latest decks. And you know what Riffle Shuffle all, are all about? Creating really funky designs. And this is definitely up there with one of their best. In terms of the last of our accessories, we brought in some more maze cases. They come in four colours. They come in a red one, a blue one, a brown and a black. Um, and this is the red one. Um, we just restocked the red and the black. They're really, really nice cases. So if you're not a clip fan, maybe getting a case is a better alternative for you. So we've got some decks here in bubble wrap. And you're probably thinking, oh, what are these? Well, these are actually the Erdenay's figure 25 decks. Now there's two of these available. As you see on the left hand side, we have the paperback which is the standard edition, as you can see, this is a paperback. Um, bit bent in the corner, because I've had this for a long time. But this is the hardback, and now as you can see, this is like a replica linen, but this is real linen, um, and which is why it is a more expensive item. You can see here, this is like a replica, but this looks like an actual book. Obviously a little bit smaller, but the actual material is just like a real book, um, like a real hardback edition. Um, and if you're interested in this deck, stick around because I will do a review of this deck at the end of the video. Right, so coming into the actual decks, more so the decks now. We've done a few restocks as well as new additions. As you can see, the slow hands playing cards have been restocked. We've brought in about four of these. We've brought back the popular Neil Patrick Harris deck. This is very popular since, well, it's a good deck. And Chris Ramsey also did a review where he sort of solves the puzzle within this deck. So that's really a really nice addition. And of course, we had to restock the Darren Brown deck because this deck is probably one of Fury 11's best decks and it is just so good. So we've restocked on the Flux playing cards because it is just a, it's just such a good deck, really good for cardistry and it's a very unique deck. To and the last deck inside this brick box, we have the Gemini Casino. But this is the yellow one. Is the most recent edition. And I'll bring your attention to this deck because we actually have a deal on for this deck. We've got a Gemini bundle. So this is the Gemini Yellow Casino and this is the Gemini Goblins. If you were to purchase both of these in a bundle, you can get these off for 10%. But if you just want to buy this deck on its own, it costs about £13.50. When you visit this product on our website, there'll be the option to buy this alone or you can buy both of these together and you'll get a discount if you buy both. So, on to the next one. This is just a few more of the Erdnays decks. But this deck, the Soundboard deck, I have to bring your attention to this because this, this is a, it's like a cassette. Um, it's such a cool design. And I believe this is the Soundboards Midnight Edition by Riffle Shuffle. I believe it's the first Soundboards since 2014, 2015, which was a blue, blue and red. And this is the Midnight Edition. 
So this this isn't actually the back design. I believe this is a Joker. But either way, really, really cool deck. And just look at that. Look at these little details. Uh, really nostalgic. So definitely a deck you should check out. So like I said, big Riffle Shuffle Hall. These are the nightclub playing cards. It comes in two colours. This is like the purple UV edition. And later on, we'll get onto the champagne yellow edition. And last deck in this box. This is the filter playing cards by Riffle Shovel. It's available in, uh, I believe, red and white. But this is the green edition. So this is V3. And I believe this is the first filter deck to come out in a few years. So, final box. This one's going to be a bit random. But yeah, let's get straight into it. So first of all, just brought in a few more Ace Fulton Femme Fatale because we're low. We've also restocked a bunch of Jerry's Casino decks. We've brought back the blue, the teal, and the coral as well, as well as the red. Just a few more items now. We got a few more yellow DKNG because we're running low. And we also restocked on the provision playing cards by Theory 11 to add to our growing Theory 11 collection. And then last but not least, the nightclub playing cards, but this is the champagne edition. This is the yellow edition. And just for reference, here is the UV edition. So it comes in champagne yellow and UV purple. So that's it for our roundup of the unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed it. So, figure 25, Erdnay's deck. This is the paperback edition. It's got this thin paper material to it. This is, this is for those of you who don't know, this is a tribute to the expert at the card table book, which is a book for magicians that teaches magic. And the unique thing about this deck is that every single card involves some sort of text from the famous book. So the deck, it comes attached um, to the paper. So I've done a little rip here so I can take it out. Um, the cellophane remains intact. So this is sort of like the, I guess, the intro to the book. It's actually a nice tuck case uh, when you think about it. And this is a, this is the black and white version of the, of the uh, cars themselves. The seal is really nice. And yeah, I believe it might be a matte tuck. So even a little illustration here. I'll give you a look at the back design first. It is metallic, even though it's a bit of a different deck. The back design it is really nice matching that green, the green tones from the book. Going on to uh, the Ace of Spades, a really nice design. Spectrum Playing Card Company, these are the people who created this deck. But here's, here, here's where it gets a little bit different. As you can see, there is writing on every single card and illustrations on some of them as well. Now these are these are actual extracts from the, from the S.W. Ernay's book itself. And as you can see, every single one has something on it. And it's just really cool. I'll literally go through every single card just so you guys can see this. You know, there's some illustrations of slights. There's text. They even say, like, it even says what figure, um, what number it is as well. Um, so basically, you're actually, you know, maybe you might be even be able to learn a couple things just by having this deck of cards because... There might be some extracts that actually give you a little bit of guidance on how to do some moves. So if you ever do lose your book, uh, get this deck because it, it might come in handy. So obviously this is going to put some people off, but for those of you who are a collector, this is a really, really cool deck to have. Um, really nice back design. Um, I think the cards are on B stock. Uh, it's got some nice jokers as well. Uh, a double backer and a blank card. So it looks great in a fan. Kind of got like B stock, kind of more of a sturdy stock. But not something you probably use to perform magic, but if you're practicing, this is great. And if you're a collector, this is also a really nice deck of cards. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If there's anything you liked in this video, it will be in a link down below where you can see all our new products. If you did like this video, please make sure to drop a comment and let me know. We also got some exciting news. The new Star Wars decks, the silver and the black, they, are, they will be arriving at the card in in approximately a week's time. As always, if you have any suggestions in what we should bring to the card, whether it be cards, card clips, you know, display cases, just let us know in the comment section because I take into account all the feedback we get. So enjoy your weekend, guys, and until the next time, I'll catch you guys later on.